Many triad community groups make it their mission to prevent this from happening. Earlier this summer, the city of Burlington donated $100,000 toward curbing teen violence. Tonight, we are getting a closer look at the groups that received that money. WFMY News 2's Grace Holland heard how their programs make a difference for kids and teenagers. At this East Burlington Community Center, you'll hear the melody of motivation. I think give the kids and the teenagers the opportunity to do something very positive in their free time. It's more than games, sports, and skills. I should have kept that. That CityGate Dream Center hopes kids and teens learn here. I tried to show them, really, what not to do. Ronnie Enoch volunteers his time and his powerful story to the teens who come through the doors. Addicted to crack cocaine for about 20 years. Um, during that time of uh, my young life, I wish I did have a place like this that I could come. A uh, positive place uh, from the negative elements that's in the community. The Dream Center is one of a handful of community groups receiving money from the city to stop teen violence. Lisa Edwards has seen a difference in students who stick with their programs over the years. They weren't involved in school very much. They didn't really particularly love school. But those same kids now are involved in the football team, are involved in the band. If they start down that path, uh, just somebody cons consistently caring about them is going to help them to make a different choice. Enoch says encouragement from parents can go a long way too. I know that you have to work. I know a lot of times that, that you're leaving them at home. Let them see that there is positive places they can come. Let them see. We want to we don't show we're not going to judge you. We're going to love you right where you are, and we're going to love you through it. One of the many programs Dream Center offers is SPIN, a weekly get-together where middle and high schoolers can play sports, take leadership classes, and share a meal together. Their fall session just got started, so it's not too late to get involved.